the ITAC tape, you're going to learn about sample preparation in laser flash instruments. The standard sample size for these instruments is a half inch diameter disc. You can use other sample sizes, but you would need special fixtures. The main goal of sample preparation for laser flash is to make the samples opaque to the laser beam. So you want to make sure that all the power of laser is absorbed by the sample and none of it goes through it. For this reason, we use a thin layer of graphite on both sides of the sample. First, I put each sample in this sample holder. After I put the samples in the sample holder, I will use a heat gun to heat them to make the solvent in the graphite spray evaporate more easily. After the samples are heated a little, I shake the graphite spray and then I apply a few layers on each side. You can see how the solvent is evaporating from the surface of the samples. After the samples are completely dry, I flip them over and do the same thing on the other side. We don't touch the surface of the samples after we apply the graphite because we don't want any oils or contamination from our skin on the sample. So I heat it again. And then apply graphite. You need to make sure that you prepare your reference with the samples at the same time so you have the same thickness of graphite on all samples. After the samples are dry, you can check with a laser pointer to make sure if our sample is opaque enough. So if you cannot see any of the beam on the other side, it means that our sample is opaque enough and we can start a test. After the samples are ready, we can load them into the instrument. We put the reference sample in the first position and the next samples in the other position. Now you're ready to set up your experiment. Stay tuned for more TA Tech Tips on thermophysical property measurements.